Hello and welcome to Factorio, No Belt, No Robot. I'm Akretio. In this episode, we will try to connect the uh, the copper to uh, the train network. Well, network. Not it's not a network yet, but we will try to connect the copper no nonetheless, and we'll try to get this. Uh, a refueling train actually working but we need some more uh, rails let's create all of them there's there we go so to get this working i'm thinking about just oh i need some more electric mining drills uh, let's create a few of those five should be enough Let's stop this. Yeah, doing that many rails, that was... It wasn't... I didn't think about it, really. That's all I can say. There we go. And the idea is that we get... Let's see. Mining drills? No. Okay. No mining drills. Well, we can use these ones. No, let's not use these ones. Let's actually uh, remove these ones. Remove this and remove this. And then now we have some mining drills. Let's see if we can do it like this. And. When we place a station, oh, let's see, another mining drill over there. Let's remove this for the time being. I will replace it. But if we place a station over here, we will have one mining drill going into the locomotive and the other two going into the, uh, the wagon so that's what we want to do and then we want to no let's get rid of that one then we want to have uh, mining drills opposite of that one as well so this will be a train for uh, for refueling or a station for refueling. And yes, I know it's on the main line. We have to work around that. We can't, in the beginning, we can't really do that. Really do anything about it. So let's call this, what to call it? Uh, coal one. Good. Now let's go into this. Let's add, let's go to manual. Add coal one until 200 seconds have passed. Can we move it? No. Okay, let's remove that, I guess. Coal one, 200 seconds. And then refuel refueling center until time have passed 30 seconds or inventory empty. And then we are not standing on top of anything. Let's go. So if everything works as it should, this train will just stop and get refueled directly from the miners. Oh yes, this actually works. I wasn't sure about that. Let's remove these. And well, we can let that be. Oh. And let's add inserters. Yes. We have a power problem in the middle, our power doesn't reach that far, but hey, what can we do? Nothing much, so we just have to accept it. Unless we have, no, we don't have anything. But we could maybe research electric, electricity distribution. Yes, let's do that research. And then we want to have a, a coal mining station. And that basically have to go through 
here in some way. And since we have left side traffic, the, oh, this is where the trains will hook up with the main line. Okay. Okay, there we go. Oh, and I went a bit too far. Let's remove some of these. There we go. Then we need... Where do we want to place the rail on this side? Could do the same with this actually. Since we don't have anything special set up yet. Could just... Set up minus. Yeah, let's go as far as we can. I think that's good. Let's remove these two minus. Of course, let's smelt all of the stuff we have mined already. Oh, maybe I should have uh, checked if the rail can actually be placed over there. It can. Great. Oh. Okay. So we have to move this. That's fine. Oh, that's fine. We just have to create another tool. Let's create steel axe. Let's create a couple of steel axes. Way faster than the than the uh, iron axe, and way way faster than nothing at all. Oh, I forgot about power. There we go. And let's restore power. That's fine. Oh, but we need to get out of here as well. I kind of forgot about that, I guess. Let's do this instead. Could go that way. Could we go inside this? Let's see if we remove that. Could even go up there. That's where I think I do want it. And we get a little bit more, uh, little bit more room for stuff. And yes, signals is missing and all that. I know, I know. So mining. Let's see where do we have. Oh, I forgot about stations. Um, train is going downwards, meaning that we need to have a bit more rail. Basically, we need to go around this lake as well. Whoops. What happens? Can we... Can we do this? Well, yes, we can, of course. Actually, let's let's just do a crazy build. Right now, I'm more after getting the functionality to work. That's good. And let's see what we can do. Getting it connected of there getting it connect yeah this is what I thought of but I don't like that idea can we get it around this that seems like <laughs> I, I'm not saying it's a good idea but it seems like less bad
let's go for this and then we just have to do something yeah maybe shorten this by one or maybe to uh, extend it But having that shadow image helps out a lot. And we might be able to use this line for something else. I hope we are. Because this line, <laughs> it's way bigger than I thought. But we might be able to use it for uh, smelting or something like that. Actually, we should uh, change this. We shouldn't. We should have this one. Going straight. There we go. I think this will. No, damn it. Um, of course, I should have started from over here. There we go. Let's remove this part of the line. And over here, let's... Yeah, let's remove this part of the line. We basically don't need it. At least I hope we don't need it. Oh yeah, we can see the train have arrived over here and this unloading, even though I have made a mistake. I don't want to go too close. That's dangerous. We need to do that, otherwise these won't get filled up. Oh, but we have actually gotten a lot of coal in a short amount of time. Oh yeah, and of course... Uh, the way it's set up now is 30 seconds and we don't have any stack bonus. Meaning that it will do what it wants to do. Let's have a look at the power. Well, I'm not using that much, but let's get some solar panels created. We do want to have solar panels as soon as possible. But, oh yeah, I forgot about that. We do have a factory over here for engines. Oh no. Of course it stopped because I didn't think about adding an output chest. Okay, let's limit this chest to one stack. I have 11 engines. I need... Uh, I need 20. Well, I don't mind if we are creating too many. Oh, we are out of copper again. For the red science. 200 over there and none over there. Let's anyway fill in the copper for that. So, how is this track? Well, we could possibly do something, but let's not worry about that right now. How, what should we do? Hmm. We are getting over here. We are loading up our... Uh, Oh. No, let's just place it. Don't try with this these ghost images. It doesn't work anyway. There we go. So we have a train. When we have the train, we have a train uh, loading copper. And then we need copper down here and we need it smelted. So maybe we should just have a station over here 
that we smelt copper wood. Let's see, do I even have another station? No, I don't. Cool. I'm missing copper. I'm not missing copper anymore. Let's leave this uh, chest over here. Then we have some spare copper. There we go. But I need uh, more station, more, yeah, stations, train stops, call them what you want. Whoa, my inventory is filling up. Yeah, let's just, if we put it down over here, we should have plenty of room, I assume. Let's just mark out where we have the, the wagons. One wagon and two wagons. So going for furnaces. I don't think we need all of the steel smelting. Meaning that we could uh, borrow a few furnaces from this area. And with borrow, of course I mean take yep then we have 10 furnaces 10 furnaces for two wagons let's see what we can do if we place a chest over there then we can have one furnace Two furnaces. Oh no, just as I removed the turret. Never mind, it worked out. Yeah, we don't need that yet. We can't even research it yet. Uh, do we have stack bonus? Can we do some stack bonus? Can turret damage upgrade? Yeah, well, no. What is everything? Circuit network, yeah. Prob I probably should use... Oh, tool belt. Yes, please. Let's go for that. If I do this, then I can place the next furnace over there. And the next chest over here, another furnace over here, but, and then we have chest over there, and this chest can go to that furnace, then we have another furnace there, another there, and another there. Okay, so we could have six, eight furnaces from one train. I think that looks quite okay. This will hopefully not be used that much. Um, yeah, let's see if we have enough engines to be able to create a train yet. Oh yes, or locomotive. So, oh, it's already done. That's fast. There we go. Let's grab half a stack of coal and put it in the locomotive. Okay. Oh, I didn't, I didn't rename any stations. So this station is Copper smelting. And this please go to 
Let's see. A dark shadow, which have to be a couple, until time passed 200 seconds. Uh, then we add a station, couple smelting, until time passed 30 seconds, or inventory empty. And then we add another station, which is, oh, until uh, inactivity. No. Oh, we had another station. Refueling center until inactivity for five seconds. Could we get that to a shot? No. Five seconds. That's fine. And then, please go. No path? Oh, of course there's no path. I forgot that I did something strange down here. Whoops. Let's extend this a bit. Grab that. Stones still take loads of time to grab. Oh, an old tree trunk in the way. Let's grab this. And then we just connect this one. Oh, not only. Now we connect it. And now we should have a path. And that train, no, oh, there's a few gaps. Now we should have a path, yeah. I haven't thought about the signals, not yet. But let's get, let's get this finished. And we need loads of insertos from the chests. There we go. Then we need to get stuff out of the chests. Um, actually, let's move this from us in this whole setup. That way we can use one chest for all of that. One chest. One chest. And one chest. Um, we need to set that one up. And of course put some fuel in it. And then we need some power. And then we need to actually put on the chests. I haven't forgotten it. I just haven't done it yet. There we go. And we have chests for the output. And I want to see what's actually happening. If we... Well, let's just go to the next one. Oh, not manual. Let's go. And then let's see. It should unload does and the smelting is starting yeah this kind of works you really want to add the uh, amount of unloading to make sure the inserters grab loads of stuff but apart from that it seems to be working fine we just need to get the defense down I think there we go Gun turret. We have one down there, so let's go around this. Actually, let's just go up to this lake.
There we go. Let's go for another one. Oh. There and there. And then we need to get rid of these turrets. Well, that one could stay. We can use it for, uh, as a backup for this one. But this one needs to do that. And then we need to repair these. And wasn't sure which uh, key was the right one. Let's have another look at the map. Okay, the map seems to be going fine. And we, yeah, we should go to that general direction. Because that's where the oil is, and the oil is the next thing we're gonna get into problems with. But, uh, I think that we have gotten this to run now. Oh, we don't have any the red, which is because we don't have any copper. Let's grab the copper. How is it? Copper. Oh, this is almost empty as well. There we go. And there we go. So this one is 1.1k and this is 1.0k. That's okay. Yeah, I know. Bad, bad joke. I'm sorry. But we got the copper train and some copper smelting up and running. And that's it for this episode. See you next time. Bye.